that shows us that, man, there's something happening here that is not accounted for by body water alone. And a couple of studies, actually multiple studies, focused on the idea of like, well, what if we're just not washing out properly? An example here is one specific study, Kandao et al., which should be linked in the description, I sure hope. Um, they did a washout period where they gained, they so they basically did some training with creatine. Then they did a bunch of training without creatine, and their gains from the creatine training phase still held in place weeks after the creatine was no longer around. And that confirms that the hypertrophy, or very highly suggests, that the muscle growth folks got from creatine really was actual muscle because the body water's gone, but you're still more jacked. It's kind of by definition means it can't be body water. Now, a similar study that was just done, which is the study we're reviewing, this Hagstrom paper, it showed that, well, actually, after washout period, we don't have any sort of uh, effect there. The wash-in period uh, accounted for that. And so we're basically saying here that, well, it was really only body water.